Hello guys, today I will be talking about the important questions that are asked from the head and neck section of anatomy during the examinations of first year MBBS. So moving on with the first chapter that is the scalp, temple and the face. From this chapter there are enumerate questions that can be asked are layers of the scalp is not that important. Arterial supply of scalp and superficial temporal region is very important. Nerve supply of the scalp and superficial temporal region is again very important. Nerve supply of face is not that important. Cutaneous nerves of face is also not that important and branches of facial artery is very important. Now coming on to the short notes that can be asked from this chapter are black eye, venous drainage of scalp and superficial temporal region, diploic veins is not that important, orbicularis oculi is also not that important, orbicularis oris is important, vaccinator is also important. Short note can also be asked on platysma, levator labii superioris and zygomaticus minor. Short note uh, on Bell's palsy is very important. Rhizomandal neuralgia can also be asked. Dangerous area of face is also important. Lacrimal apparatus is not that important. Secretomotor fibers for lacrimal gland is very important. Now moving on to the next chapter that is side of neck and anterior triangle of neck. The various enumerate questions from this chapter are muscles forming the floor of the posterior triangle, boundaries and content of all the triangles of the neck and branches of the external carotid artery. Now, Moving on to the short notes that can be asked are deep cervical fascia, carotid seat. These two are very important. Retropharyngeal spaces are not that important. Sternocleidomastoid muscle is again not that important. Torticollis is important. Rye neck is again important. And posterior triangle of neck is not that important. Short note on cervical plexus is also not that important. And structures lying below the hyoid bone is also not that important. Short note on ansa cervicalis is very important. Moving on to the chapter parotid gland and submandibular region. The various enumerate questions that can be asked are the structures pierced by the parotid duct is very important. Superficial and deep relations of hyoglossus muscle is also very important. Now moving on to the long questions. A long question on parotid gland can be asked and you have to write about the external features, relation, the structures within the gland, parotid duct blood supply, nerve supply and the clinical. This question is very, very important. A long question on parotid gland. Relations on relations of hyoglossus is an enumerate question. A long question on submandibular gland can also be asked. In this you have to write about the features, relations, duct, blood and the nerve supply along with the clinical. A short note on the submandibular ganglion can also be asked. Moving on to the next chapter that is the temporal and the infratemporal region. The various enumerate questions that can be asked are boundaries and contents of infratemporal region is not that important. Branches of maxillary artery is very, very important. Branches of mandibular nerve is also very important. Now, a long question can be asked on temporomandibular joint. And in this case, you have to write about the type of joint, articular surfaces involved, ligaments, blood and nerve supply, articular disc, movement, clinical. And a short note on otic ganglion can be asked. Moving on to the chapter, structures present within the neck. From this chapter, enumerate questions like venous drainage of thyroid gland, branches of subclavian artery, branches of internal jugular vein, and branches of internal carotid artery. All these questions are important. Long question on thyroid gland is very, very important. Long question on parathyroid gland is not that important. Long question on lymphatic drainage of head and neck is also not that important. A short note on steroid apparatus can be asked. Guys, do like and subscribe my videos for more informative informations. Thank you.